uh, this trail that I'm hiking on is called the Dragonfly Trail. Of course, uh, it started back a little ways back, so I'm just uh, probably just about over with it. Uh, and uh, it's supposed to be the easiest trail around. So, uh, to me, it looks like it's an easy trail. And, uh, so far, so good. Now, what's up ahead there is a, seems like a little bit of a, uh, what they call a gap jump. I think it's an old one, though. I don't think it's being used anymore. Uh, don't think I'm in that league yet. <laughs> All right, let's keep hiking. All right, well, so far so good. Uh, there's probably some coyotes around here. Wouldn't doubt that there would not be. Maybe some bobcats. You know, I found myself hiking fast for some reason. Walking fast. I don't know why, but I guess that's the way I walk or hike. And, uh, so I, I guess I can't help it. You know, I'm not trying to get anywhere fast. Uh, just, uh, leisurely walking. Uh, so today is, uh, today Wednesday today's Wednesday let's see five six seven twenty seventh and you're wondering why you're probably wondering why why isn't he at work <laughs> well guys I'm taking the rest of the year off until 2018 so you know it's just time to lay back and uh, get some of these trails down pad before I come out and ride them, actually ride them, because this is a new trail for me, and I just want to get a, uh, I just want to get a feel for the trail, I guess, you know, more or less, hiking it, see what it's all about, and I think this concludes the Dragonfly Trail, I think so, this is the main trail, I'm guessing the the trail, the main trail that uh, pretty much surrounds the whole park. The white trail, I guess you would call it. I'm not sure. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Okay, guys. Uh, this is the continuation of the Dragonfly Trail. So we're not over yet. Looks like three quarter of a mile. Let's see. Dragonfly. Three quarter mile, probably to the end of the trail. So let's keep going. Looks like we got a little bit of a rock climb here. Up and over. And you've got a little rest area here. Oh, it looks like somebody left their little loppers there. Uh, trail maintenance crew, I guess. And it looks like we've got a little bit of a trail uh, here called uh, Patriots Trail. I think that's a really long trail. And uh, don't know if I'm up for that right now. I want to make sure where I am. I think this is, let me see, let me let's go through here. Let's just, let's just go down this main trail. I think, you know, all the trails split off from this main trail. This is the main trail that splits, I believe. Uh, 
Wow, all kinds of building materials there. Looks like they're building some sort of, I don't know if that's a, some sort of structure, but this is where they keep all the materials, I guess, somewhat. Uh, ooh, nice looking frame for a ramp, I guess, jump ramp. That's nice. Okay, let's go to keep going down this main trail, because I just want to see what comes off this trail. There's all the trails loop off this trail, I believe. Uh, I don't see. Okay, here goes the trail here. Let's see what this one's called. Okay, this is still the Patriot Trail. Cuts down in there, and it's the white, white uh, markers, I guess. Yeah. So it looks like it. I guess it came out from over there. Well, let's start right here and see where it takes us. Let's see. Of course, I don't have a selfie stick, so I'm holding my camera with my hand, with my walking stick in the other hand. Let's see where this takes us. Patriot Trail. I think it's a huge trail. That's all right. I'm set up for a huge walk anyway. Got water and Gatorade with me. And uh, there's a little rock obstacle here. I'm in rock. And it looks like we go to the right. Let's go ahead and go to the right, see what's up. So we turn right. And the trail is still unrideable right now. This is supposed to be a top-notch mountain bike park here in Cedar Hill. And I'm sure uh, and we've got some houses that are like literally this is their backyard. Wow. Who wouldn't want to live in one of those houses? I'd be riding this trail every day. Except on the days you can't ride it. Because they don't want too many ruts on the trail, of course. Want a nice smooth trail. But hiking it uh, doesn't leave any ruts. So I don't think I'm really bothering the trail by hiking the trail. And I'm trying to stay off the trail as much as I can while hiking beside it. So that's another good thing to do. Whoa. Alright guys, still walking the Patriot Trail. And we're coming to a intersection here. Looks like we've got the Patriot Trail going that way. And we've got uh, Crooked Tree Trail 2.2. Two and one eighth of a mile. Oh, I'm sorry, not two. One point eighteen miles. So, uh, it's rated easiest. That's the kind I like to start out with. So let's go this way. Patriot Trail goes this way anyway. So we'll go to the Patriot Trail. We know where we're at. Not gonna get lost, even though it's the first time I've been here. But I'll be shutting off the camera off and on because it's just uh, not anything too interesting about the trail unless I run into an obstacle that uh, needs to be checked out, you know. But with an easy trail, I believe there's not too many obstacles, just uh, rocks mainly, roots, but nothing really bad so far. Uh, the Dragonfly Trail looked pretty easy. It has a uh, a jump on a dragonfly trail called the dragonfly drop 
and uh, it's just a what two foot drop maybe less than that that I'll probably try when I come out here on my mountain bike and uh, get some confidence you know there's a little bit of a root system here and uh, yeah anytime you can get a low drop uh, succeed in a low drop you know it gives you lots of confidence in your mountain biking and uh, you know feel of uh, accomplishing something uh, you know for that day okay we're coming up to another intersecting trail I believe this is still the main trail uh, there's left and then there's right so we're going right as arrow is pointing to us to the Patriot Trail Patriot Trail up ahead to the right but let's pass this sign here for a second I want to see I want to see what that other sign is right there saying so let's go down there and see what that sign is saying what trail that is I know I'm gonna have an awesome time here guys by walking this trail you can even feel it you're gonna have an awesome time hiking it or uh, mountain biking it okay there it is exit to trailhead I see yeah this is the main the main trail that takes you uh, that takes you uh, out to the trailhead I guess and, and this other one is a ranger let's see it's called ranger main loop all right guys I'm gonna shut it down for a second and see what comes up all right guys I'm back uh, this you know tell you the truth I'm not sure what trail I'm on <laughs> there was a confusion of the signs up ahead I believe this is still the Ranger loop so check this out guys first you drop off of that route right there okay you drop off that route it's about a well, eight inch drop then you're gonna go down this trail here with rocks I mean it's rocky and there's a ledge right there you can see the ledge and uh, I'm sure you're gonna go down I don't think I'm think I'm going to right the wrong way you go down this trail you don't come up it's a one-way system on these trails and uh, that's a real nice let me turn around and let you see what I just came down and it's a little little hill right there got its rock ledge there on that part and uh, come down and you got this wooden bridge to cross and you better haul ass up this hill as soon as you cross that wooden bridge if you want to make it it's a little bit of a climb I'm sure it can be done you just gotta prepare for it hop over the roots on this trail hop over the trail roots yeah all right guys I'll let you know when I come to something else interesting on this trail all right guys camo dude still on the uh, biking trail but I'm hiking it so uh, yeah I'm hiking the trail uh, right now it's closed to mountain bikers because it's kind of wet you know and it's understandable 